Welcome back. He's best known for this track. Let me give you some love and affection. The U.S. Virgin Islands based artist is currently in Jamaica promoting new projects and passes through our stage with one of these projects right now. Fresher. <laughs> Fresher, welcome, sir. Blessed love. Bless. Good to have you. All right, so what project? Are you promoting in Jamaica? Well, well, at this time, I'm promoting a Lover's Rock EP. Mm -hmm. um, songs like Like It Is and No Worry Yourself. And, and oh, it's, like a, it's, an entire, it's an EP? Yes. How many songs? It's about six or seven songs, but right now we're promoting one and two of the songs from the EP. Why is it necessary to promote in Jamaica? Well, Jamaica is the headquarters for reggae music, and, mm -hmm. and um, I think like before when when I was here a lot often promoting love and affection, say back in 2007, mm -hmm. eight, you know, it was it, it made a great difference, you know, towards. Oh, it has. Uh, yeah, you know. Um, mm -hmm. So I've been away for for quite some time, you know, personal reasons, and still working with the music and touring and doing stuff like that. But I think it has been very necessary for me to be visible in Jamaica and, and doing a lot more work in Jamaica as I've been doing in the past. Okay, so. What is it like to be based in the Virgin Islands? Um, and you're a national of that island, aren't you? Well, you were born yes, I there? I born and raised in St. Thomas, you was Virgin Island. Mm -hmm. you know, um, I only left the Virgin Islands when I was probably about 21 years old. You know, um, grew up throughout the whole culture. But as a young youth, I've always studied the Jamaican culture, Jamaican reggae music, you know, from 9, 10 years old, Shabba Ranks and, you know, the early Bounty Killer and stuff like that. So. Um, it was no stranger to me to, to want to become a part of that culture as an artist. But before I was a drummer and playing trumpet, mm -hmm. so I would find myself playing reggae songs on the trumpet, you know, playing the drums with the reggae beat and stuff like that. So there's always been a part of my soul to, to explore and, and become a part of that industry. Do, do people make, do fans make, especially outside of the Caribbean, mm -hmm. artists, or outside of the Virgin Islands, do they make a distinction between you and the Jamaican uh, reggae artists? Always, always. They do know the difference? Well, at times. Or you know, do, um, do they care? Most of the, most of the fans, early fans, could, couldn't distinguish because of my, the accent I'll speak, like, mm -hmm. you know, like I was born and raised in Jamaica, through the love of the culture, yes. you know, but um, those that really seek to know who Pressure is and have read my bio and stuff like okay. that get to know where pressure is from and through interviews and stuff like that, yeah. Yeah, because I know that, um, you know, mm -hmm. in the wider space, sometimes it doesn't yeah, really matter. It doesn't really matter. Especially when you're from the Caribbean. Yeah, definitely. All right, so you, you're going to drop a new video for us from yes. this EP. Yeah, man. Right? Let's go to it. Picture this, house and land, king size bed for your gully and bad money can buy love. But Shabba don't tell me, say anything me want if it pay them bad. Right now, me a fall in love Does the heart of the fall in mode? Me no perfect, anything can happen But it's all in love All right, now worry yourself New one from Pressure Pressure, you know, I like this song This is a nice track Personally, um, personally I have to give it to you, Brad I like this track Much love, yes And I hope our viewers um, who are watching now, now around the world Can appreciate it as much as I do I hope so as well It's really nice it's okay, so this is your only video from the EP? Yes, at this time. Okay, yeah, and it was shot on location in the in, Virgin in, Islands? In the US Virgin Islands, yes. Okay, nice. Yeah, so you're yeah. selling your, your country, your, well, your island. You know, of course, I'm proud of where I come from. You yes. St. Thomas, US Virgin Islands. The whole Virgin Islands. You know? Okay. Yeah. Oh yeah, they must be proud of you, man. You must be a big star over there, aren't you? <laughs> you must be the biggest star in the Virgin Islands right now, Virgin. <laughs> You think it sound good. But you're rapping in this. You're DJing in this. Yeah, well, before and I even start sing, I was DJing. You know? Yeah. Uh, like I told you, Shabba Ranks, I'm an artist. And the Bounty Killer, them, I'm an artist. Mm -hmm. So we start because, you know, I come from a family that really into music. And I used to take little choir lessons from in elementary and uh, middle school and stuff like that. So the singing part wasn't too far, you know. But, you know, and then the singing part started coming, you know, when I realized, like, you know, Artists like Sizzler start to use singing into the DJ. Then you're hearing um, the Jamaican and the Capleton them with the sing J. Mm -hmm. So I'm really interested in that mm -hmm. because before it was just straight, no, no melody, just lyrics. You know? Yeah. yeah. So we learned that over the years through the music and the artists them that I love. 
who are Jamaican artists and, and helped me to want to become an artist as well through the music. Yeah. Pressure, it's so good to have you right here on stage, much sir. Much love, much love. Much respect, sir, and walk good. And when you come again, we hope to, yes. to report good news. Oh, you mean? More good news from this EP. Yeah, thanks. All right, there you have him right here on stage. Pressure from the U.S. Virgin Islands. Stay with us still to come right here on stage. Grammy nominees, Barton Levy, and later, the messenger, Luciano. All coming up. We'll be back. Hi, thanks for watching our video. Hope you have enjoyed it. Please subscribe to our channel by clicking right here and enjoy so much more where that came from. Right, so I came up with the idea. I don't know, the idea just come up to me with the mask and all of that. So um, the people, them kind of request it. So I just got to work with it. I'm just going to let it be my image.